Happy Sunday, everyone. It's your girl, Sherry Jones of Sherry Speaks Life. The power of life and death is in the tongue, and I choose to speak life. Welcome to my Sunday Inspirations. If this is your first time watching, thank you so much for taking time out of your schedule to watch my video. I hope something I say today is inspiring and encouraging for you. My topic today is, oh, what a glorious day. Today was truly a glorious day for our family. Our son, Devin, was baptized today. And for those whose faith may not be familiar with baptism, um, in the Christian faith, particularly Baptists, uh, we are Baptists, we baptize by submerging. And what that means is um, when someone confessed Christ as their Savior, they have accepted him as their Lord and Savior, confessed their sins, then the next step is to be baptized. And baptism is representation of the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ. So what we do is we submerge the person into the on water, and that's representing the death and the burial. And when they are, come out of the water, that represents the resurrection of Jesus. And it's an outward showing of the inward change that happened in their heart when they accepted Jesus. So our son is eight years old, and he has had a love for God since he was a little boy. He's had questions about God, questions about the Bible, and he has always had a spiritual maturity beyond his years. And so it was just a wonderful experience to have your child follow in the same footsteps of your faith as you have. And I think that's what we all hope and dream of, that our children, our legacy, would share the same faith and the same love and importance of faith that we have. It's always a glorious time when you know that the person that the Lord has trusted you to raise is following the right path. So it was a wonderful and a blessed day. We were so excited. We have family and friends come from near and far to celebrate with us. So my message today is just about having a glorious day. A day that the Lord has made a day that the Lord has blessed you with to do more for him. Was your day glorious today? I hope that it was. What great thing did you do for Jesus today? What great way did you spread his gospel? What great way did you spread his love? Did you share in worship services today? Did you tell someone about Jesus? Did you pray? Did you read your word? Every day is a new glorious day for us to celebrate Jesus. And it was a especially glorious day for us to be able to share this moment with our son. So make every day a glorious day. Make every day a day that you celebrate the Lord a day that you celebrate your faith and that you share your faith with someone else. If you have children and know that they are your legacy, they are what will be left behind when you are gone. So make sure that you are instilling your faith and your beliefs in them. If you don't have children, I'm sure that you are surrounded by children. You have access to children. And they are our future. And so even if it's not your biological child, you have a chance to impart something positive and to leave a legacy through a child. Make sure that it's something positive. Make sure that it's something uplifting. And make sure that it's something glorious. I hope you all enjoyed this Sunday inspiration. And I hope to see you next time when I post Sunday Inspirations on my Sherry Speaks Life page. I also go live on Wednesdays at 9 p.m. Please like my page. And until next time, 
I love you all so much with the love of Christ. Be blessed and have a wonderful and glorious day. Bye-bye.